offer thing first, please be aware that we at Dr. Fee are no financial advisor. This video is for entertainment purpose only. Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how you can easily transfer your crypto from CoolCoin to another exchange or wallet, such as MetaMask. Of course, we want to keep the fees for doing this as low as possible. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. I'm here logged into my CoolCoin account on the desktop version. Don't worry, if you are using the app, the process is the same. As a trader, I usually do not want to be exposed to market volatility when transferring funds. Therefore, I usually choose to transfer stable coins such as USDT, USDC, or BUSD. Additionally, the fees for transferring stable coins are usually on the lower end. For KuCoin, transferring stable coin has fee as low as one US dollar. For example, for USDT. If you would like to optimize the fee you are paying for the transfer, you can also choose, for example, Litecoin, which has even lower fee. However, as mentioned before, I prefer to work with stable coins. To transfer funds, I click on the little wallet symbol on the upper navigation bar and choose the account from which I would like to withdraw. This will bring me to the following page, and I find the withdrawal field on the top. As a next step, we select the coin we would like to withdraw in the drop-down menu here. We select USDT, as said earlier. As a following step, we have to pass the address we want to send the USDT to and select the network. One important aspect to save fees during the transfer is to choose the right network, as the fee structure differs significantly. If we, for example, would choose ERC20, so Ethereum, we would have to pay 25 USDT in fees, while for TRC20, so the Tron network, we are only paying 1 USDT currently. If we are transferring the crypto to another centralized exchange, we have to check which networks are supported by them. As a rule of thumb, BSC, Polygon, and Tron are usually on the lower end of fees. If we want to transfer to a specific chain, for example, into our MetaMask, we of course have to select the chain we want the funds to receive in. In this example, we want to transfer our funds to another centralized exchange. The trading fees among different exchanges vary a lot and especially for traders. This can have a huge effect on their trading performance, sometimes many thousand dollars per month. Unfortunately, with all the different tiers and the requirements for those tiers, it is very complex to compare how much you will pay at other exchanges for your trade. We have used Dr. Fee here to identify how much fee saving potential we have, as they automatically analyze how much we would have paid at different exchanges based on our actual trades. In this example, that's transferred the funds to Binance. This could, however, be different for everyone based on their trading activity, the products they are trading, and etc. So, as a next step, we have to check at the exchange we want to receive the funds, which network are supported to receive crypto, in this case, USDT at Binance. I'm now logged in at Binance, let's go to Wallet, Fiat, and Spot, and when there, find USDT. Here's our USDT, and we want to receive the USDT here. Hence, we click on Deposit. Just like at CoolCoin earlier, we have to select the network for the transfer. We have seen at CoolCoin that the fees for transferring on the Tron network are quite cheap. And here we see that deposits based on TRC20 are available. This is very important, you have to select the correct chain both at the wallet you are sending the funds from as well as the wallet you are receiving the funds at. If not, your transfer might be lost. Okay, given that both CoolCoin and Binance support TRC20 and the fees are low for transferring USDT, let's select this one. Click on Tron here in the Binance account and you will see the address you can send the USDT to. Let's click here to copy. We go back to our CoolCoin account and pass the address in the field Wallet Address. 
This will automatically load the following page, and we can see that the fees for transferring are indeed only one USDT. Now, we can type in the amount of USDT we would like to transfer. For this example, here I will just transfer the minimum amount, which is 5 USDT. We're pretty much done. Let's double check one more time. USDT, Thrown at work. This is the address we copy from Binance and the amount. Let's click Withdraw, perform the authentication, and we're done. Note that the transfer might take a little time. So I'll skip this few minutes here and let's go to our Binance account. Yes, as we can see, the USDT has arrived. The process is pretty straightforward and quick. Given that some exchanges charge a multiple of others at our given tier level, switching exchange and benefiting from much lower fee might really be worthwhile. Especially if it can save hundreds or thousands of dollars per month depending on your trading activity and volume. The process will be the same for transferring USDT from CoolCoin to any other exchange or another wallet. You just have to find the correct address you copy in at CoolCoin, whether it is from Binance, FTX, or the wallet of your choice. Pay attention that you have selected the same network and have chosen the same coin both for sending and receiving end of the transaction. If you liked the video and think it was helpful, please leave us a like on the video. We develop plenty of helpful videos for traders, especially also for analyzing your own trading behavior and identifying improvement potentials. To stay up to date, just subscribe our channel and turn on the notification bell in order to be notified once we upload new videos. Thank you.